So today's, uh, well, this video is going to be uh, more, I'm going to do a little compilation of stuff here over the next day and a half or so. Um, don't really have anything super planned as far as uh, being outdoors, but uh, taking a long weekend trip down to uh, Panhandle, Florida, Destin area. Um, have a have a house down here, so um, come down to get some sunshine, get out of the ice and snow for a few days, um, do some things on the house. But um, so be a little bit of beach walking, uh, maybe a little run, uh, probably tonight or tomorrow, and uh, maybe a little stroll on the the uh, little uh, beach cruiser bikes that we have. So uh, that's what this video will likely end up being. Um, so I'll just put together a little compilation of, of a day or two here on this short trip. But uh, something different out of the snow and, and, and rain and, and ice, as I said before, but uh, getting outside. So uh, I don't know if we'll call this day, I don't know what I'm at now, eight, seven, nine, or maybe multiple days. We'll see how much video I get, but uh, something different. And... Uh, just getting outside.
Just uh, finishing up a short run. Uh, just saw on the beach. But, um, that route I took, you don't get the paths on the other side of the road, but it's still a great path to run. Just did uh, one mile out, one mile back, and now I'm just going to do a short long loop of the neighborhood. I'll take you on the tour. A big party here. There's like 12 people in that hot tub. Weather today was in the low 70s. Sunny, not a cloud in the sky. But all of that, sitting on the beach. There was a uh, there was a little breeze that kept me cool. So yeah, if you're wearing a t-shirt, you're fine. So this compound I'm gonna come up on here in the neighborhood is uh, quite the quite the property. It's. Uh, The story is it was supposedly owned by the one and only Miss Britney Spears at one point. So it's a full house and then a pool house with living quarters and then a garage with 
living quarters. One of the two boardwalks in the neighborhood down to the private beach. shoes. So back to that house. It was supposedly owned by Britney Spears. I don't believe it is any longer, but to the best of my knowledge, it sits there. Very few, getting very little use. I don't think anybody's living there, and I don't believe they'll run it out. So, most of this neighborhood is rentals at this point. There are a few year-round residents and a few private residents with uh, people who do not rent. But for the most part, it's beach rentals. Come up on the uh, second and sort of more popular larger boardwalk. Sun's getting ready to set. It, it is beautiful sunsets here in the panhandle. Uh, the sun here is on you all day from left to right if you're facing the ocean. So in the morning, your left side gets burned, and uh, in the evening, the right side. So just gotta be mindful of that. You really don't get a break. See all the construction. It's the off season, so uh, but he does a lot of work to their house. Did a little bit to our property. Fixed the toilet. Changed some handles and locks on doors, and uh, a few other odds and ends. There are two empty lots on the beach that uh, one could purchase, build a house. They don't come cheap. Uh, nothing in this neighborhood comes cheap. And the second empty lot. There's no fence there. So a few moments ago in the video, you probably saw me run by this gate as I turned away from the boardwalk along the ocean. So I'll turn around here. Can't get out that gate. And finish up the rod. Gonna get to just about three miles. Just want to get something in before we head to dinner. Uh, too nice out. My house is down that street, but I'm gonna go around and get a little bit more distance in here. Over a quarter more mile, and I'll get to three miles. So, so just finished. Go out and back on the one on the street. 
get me it's, uh, exactly three miles. So, uh, I didn't want to try what I wanted to accomplish. Still not in the best shape, but I'm getting there very slowly. Um, one of the things I don't know that I mentioned in any of the videos is, you know, this, these videos I'm doing, as, as I said from the beginning, it's just about me. They're motivated to motivate me. They're just a thing for me to do to keep myself motivated to uh, meet my personal goals. But uh, kind of having fun doing it. And uh, enjoy trying to keep them uh, different, varied things like that but uh, really it's just I'm trying to get in shape and have some personal goals that I would like to accomplish and uh, just working at it but uh, one thing I haven't really mentioned is you know this isn't these aren't the only sort of exercise that I've been getting I do a spinning class uh, it's been once a week now for I don't know five weeks or so so far and I'll plan to do that for probably another month and then uh Really, we'll just be outside as much as possible once the weather up north is finally breaking. Um, but uh, I also do run on the treadmill. I have a, a new treadmill um, that has kind of like an iPad built into it. And they have these virtual runs where you run with a trainer. And those are interesting and they're in interesting places that, you know, I certainly would enjoy to be in real life. You know, sort of... Uh, a desert run, a canyon run, and then uh, a mountain run in Montana. So those have been kind of cool. But uh, just trying to slowly get myself in shape, keep myself healthy. But body's been revolting a little bit, getting old. Gray beard. Let's see. Uh, but uh, still, still got enough, a little fight left in me. Trying to stay as young as I can. But I uh, hope you hope today's run was scenic at the very least and you know certainly uh, a variety from the snow and and uh, rain and the other videos I've done so far so uh, it's nice to be in some a little bit warmer weather for a few days uh, gotta head back north tomorrow but uh, actually be back in Florida again next weekend on another little adventure with one of my kids so back and forth and then as I mentioned before, I'll be head to Colorado, so back to the cold and the snow uh, for a few days uh, at the beginning of March. So, some cool stuff in the works, but in the meantime, I'll just keep making these little short videos and add them to my collection. So, uh, this is uh, day eight. I don't know nine. I keep. I should. I should look that up before I do these videos. Sounds a little smarter, but getting there. Um, getting into double digits here. And I think I'm, you know, on a good pace through the winter to, to meet that goal of 100 days outside. <laughs>